Good morning, Richard Eckley here. Happy Wednesday to you. Another week flying through, halfway through it now. Uh, we're on Wednesday, so on a Relationship Wednesday on your four keys to a healthier, happier you. And I said on Monday, I was down in London, I was, uh, did an interview as well. Sat in an audience of an interview with uh, David McCorkle, I said billionaire with Rob Moore, millionaire with them. And I actually got to ask him some questions. And the one question I asked him was, well, what mentor did you have when you sort of first started out when you were growing up? And his answer was, oh, that's quite interesting. His answer to that, his biggest mentor was his mum. He said she was an amazing person. His mum was just one of those really encouraging people, supportive people, really caring person. He said and he, she was his biggest mentor for years. He said, unfortunately, she actually died two years ago, aged 103, but she lived a full life. But he said she was always supporting and helping him. He said, he gave a great story. He said the one time that he was most upset about, which didn't upset her, but he said his friend came over and, and she was about in her, in her mid, mid late 80s. And he'd thrown his, his his shoes on the floor and just went around and was mucking around. And she came down the stairs, tripped over the, the the shoes on the floor, and actually fell on the floor and actually broke her hip and had to go to the hospital and broke her hip. And of course, she had to have all the this, the repair this, repair the hip and then the rest of the recovery and everything else. And he and he was saying to her, "I'm just so sorry, mum. The, the, the shoes there, my friend. I just I'm so sorry." And she said to him, "Oh, don't worry. If, if that hadn't happened, I'd never have met the lovely people in the hospital." And he said and that was her attitude, the way she was to life. It was just, she embraced life, she enjoyed life, and she was always encouraging people, helping people. And that's just the sort of person you sort of need to have around you as a, as a, as you're growing up, there's helped so much to have a good base, good support system in place for you. And like Rob Moore was saying, well, he never had that growing up. His, he had he had a very, good, his mum was brilliant, his mum was amazing, amazing mum he had. And his dad was great as well, but there was a few sort of issues and stuff going on. Which not everyone, everyone has a, a lovely upbringing. There. Sometimes there's problems, there's things that don't go quite quite so planned. So sometimes you need to look out for yourself to, to actually find a mentor who you can connect with that can help you, support you and keep you on track and help you get where you want to get to. So we can all achieve what we want to in life, but sometimes we do need someone to help guide us a bit to get the right direction to keep us on the right track and just to, to make sure, yeah, we're okay, we're doing okay and everything's going okay. So sometimes if you haven't got that sort of support and thing in your own home, Sometimes you need to go outside of your home and look for someone and find someone to help mentor who's, who's doing what you'd like to do, who's heading down the right path, and you can connect with them, and they can obviously help you get where you want to go. So there's sometimes, and also you can do that for your own kids. You can be a, a good mentor for your kids. Guide them, help them. That's the one thing I said with, with, with kids. You, all you can do is guide your children. You can't control your kids. Your kids are individual people, and they're going to do what they're going to do. But all you can do is guide them the best way you can. Give them the best advice you can give them. Show them love, show them support, and say that, yes, they can achieve whatever they want to achieve, but they have to cut their own furrow, as they say, and make their own path, so we can just be there to support them. So that's something I said, um, I was saying, if you haven't got that support in your home, you can reach outside to find someone that can help you, you can look around and find support, and then you could be that support to someone else as well, which is a, a good way to be. That's my little thought today on Relationship Wednesday. Are you a mentor? Would you like to be a mentor? You can help other people, or perhaps you can you can sort of learn it for a mentor yourself and try and find one just to help support you on your way. It does help so much when you've got people that are supporting you, helping you. Just just your mindset, that's the main thing they ever do it for. It's not sort of finance, it's not other things. It's mainly a, your mental mindset. Once you get that sorted out, you have a good mentor to help you. You can then find your path on through much easier. That's my little thought today. Have yourself a good day today. Enjoy. All the best.